Hello YouTube, this is Chuck the Hoss, and I just made this pretty fairly big house in creative mode. Um, nothing really too special. I just want to show off some more redstone. Um, as you can see, the doors open at the same time with one pressure plate. I'll show you some redstone wiring at the end with that. Here's my storage room. It's inspired by Etho's storage room, but it's much different. Instead, I have uh, these pistons hooked up to a T-flip-flop, which reveal lava. And as you can see, as I walk out, they will close. Here, I, uh, well, on both sides there's buttons, but I really just have one disguised um, for this. It has a piston door right there, and, you know, here's a chest for your diamonds or whatever, who knows. And here's the button to get back out. The redstone wiring there is nothing too special. It's just two pistons hooked up to some redstone wire wrapped around. Nothing under those stairs. Um, here's just some rooms. Here's, I guess, the bedroom. There's a creeper face. Always gotta have one of those. Here's uh, a portal room. Once again, nothing too special. Just for looks, really. And, um, okay guys, time to show you the wiring. Okay, I'm back. This is the storage room inspired by Etho's storage room. And here's some of the wiring. Now what I got here is those are the pressure plates hooked up to this super compact T flip-flop. This T flip-flop's output is right there. And it wires up to all these pistons. And over there too. And as you can see, it goes up to this torch. Now, there's a torch right there, block, torch, block, torch, block, torch, all the way up. If I can get out of here. Wow. Fail. Okay, I just failed for five minutes there. But, um, that's okay. Guess I'll show you the top now. Here is the top of the storage room. There's a torch that comes out, and it feeds into here. This inverts the signal, and it goes to all these pistons, which does the same thing down below. Now, for the doors, the doors was pretty easy. Um, I made it myself. This is nothing too special. Okay, as you can see here, the pressure plates are above those. Pressure plates are above those. Now, what happens is, is this connects the two. And, whoop, little lag. And then it inverts that torch, which inverts that one, which opens the door. Same thing on the other side. And since they're linked, it opens on both sides and closes on both sides. Alright guys, I'm about to show you the wiring for the piston door. If I can break through here. Now the button's on the other side of that piston. So what happens is when the piston gets pushed out, this block gets moved. Under there is a torch. When the block's over the torch, it powers the repeater, which powers that redstone, which powers those two pistons. Now, for the inside to get out, there's a button on the other side of that. It just feeds right along through this line to the repeater, which also powers the piston. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe, like, comment, do whatever you feel like doing, and have a nice day.